Hey everybody, welcome back. Um, Frank got those floor joists in that I showed in the last video. And I kind of give you a little glimpse of where the shower and the washer and dryer are going to go. So we started laying the floor and we are using liquid nail construction adhesive um, to uh, cement that down along with screwing, which you'll see in this video. And um, we used a Vantec flooring also um, for this, and you'll see that in, in just a few minutes. But it's just a quick overview of what we're doing on, on this part. And it was really nice to have the floor solid um, instead of walking over just boards that were laid down. And every time you walked on them, they, they kind of rocked. It made it a little hard on a ladder. But... Um, Frank did a great job getting this in, and you'll see at the very end all of it um, done. We did not put new flooring underneath the shower. We just um, used the exi existing floor. All right, hey everybody. I know it's been a long time. Uh, distracted by a lot of different things, but we're over at the shop house, and let me give you an update. And as you can see, that's where the washer and dryer are going to go, and that's the new shower. We just have drywall to do, and um, there isn't a light in here yet, but as you can see, back here is where the toilet's going to go. We're going to put a fake wall right up there and that's the new vent stack and there's the new shower it's a small shower but we figured a small shower was better than a one a one bath and then the vanity is going to go here now Frank has already got all the he's got all the plumbing done for that bathroom we do it other than water plumbing. He's got all the waste and vent pipe done. He's done that underneath the house as well. We put in a new base down there uh, that was all rotted out and again we still have to do all the... We got the PEX plumbing we still need to do all through the house. And then we went to the main bathroom just to check some stuff out. If you'll recall when we did the Main Street rental, uh, when we did that one, <clears throat> we ended up tearing out the kitchen cabinets because the galvanized drain and vent pipe had rusted and caused mold and everything. Well, let me take you into the main bathroom. And we ended up removing that pipe as well. Uh, it was galvanized, and it had already started um, rusting in there, so we just took the vanity out, um, just to double check, and I'm glad that we did. So, that is out, and Frank still has that vent and drain to do. I came over here the other day and I washed the walls to prep them for painting which is what I'm going to do today. We are going to put in a new toilet and I told Frank he could not put in the toilet without me peeking behind it. 
since uh, there's a patch that's never had paint. And it's coming along. Um, we didn't want to bore you with all the tiny little details of everything we were doing and there's nothing worse than watching paint dry. But I wanted to give you a quick update of what we were doing. Um, it's been raining and Frank's been working hard at other places. Um, so we got to a place where I can do something to be helpful and um, we're going to try to hit it hard this week and then get this thing rented. So I still have a lot of um, nail holes. I forgot the spackle today, but we'll get that and come over here and get these nail holes filled so that when Frank's ready for me to, to paint, we'll get that done, get the flooring in, and we're getting there. I think we're actually starting to put things back together. That would be good. All right. Okay, everybody, I got it painted. Cut in and painted. I'm a little speckly, but that's okay. Uh, I've got some on my glasses. That's okay too. These are only a dollar. But anyway, um, let's see what you think. Um, I got one coat on, and I was thinking that might be enough. The only problem is, is right there where the toilet is, that is dark blue. But again, it's gonna be behind the toilet, but at least it's not quite so noticeable. So we'll see, but everything else is done. I think it looks pretty good. Unfortunately, I'm going over a really bad paint job. So um, when you go over a really bad paint job, even if you do a good job, it doesn't look great. But anyway, I did not do the ceiling. I only did the walls and it did pretty good. You can't see where the, only I think in this corner where the light is, can you see where the, the border used to be? I don't know how to fix that. You can kind of see that line, but I don't know how to fix that. Anyway, it's done. I think it looks good. And um, I didn't get any on the floor. I got some all over me, but you know, that's okay. I, I wash up pretty easy. So, and as you can see, my shirt has had more. So, not a big deal. So anyway, until next time. Hey everybody. Thanks so much for stopping by Frank and Carrie's Adventures. We really enjoy making these videos for you. And if you enjoy watching them, remember, you can always like and subscribe. Until next time.